That's more than my take home wage for a month. Becky's a single mom with two sons. For the last seven years, she's dedicated her life to looking after her boys. Life's tough and she only just manages to get by. As long as the boys are okay, I'll just have a sandwich myself or their leftovers. Multimillionaire barrister and property group CEO Roy wasn't born into money. I grew up in Shepherd's Bush, West London. You know, we weren't rich, but I had a, had a good life. Roy's battled hard to make his millions. For one week, Becky and Roy are swapping homes, yeah. budgets. Uh, I'm, I'm shocked. And lives. I actually can't get... Holy... No. OK. That's a lot of money. Sheesh. <laughs> do not hold it. So what do you think? This, 20, no, 40, 60. No way. 20, 40, 60, 80. I've lost count. 700. She's got 64 pounds and five pence. I, I wasn't expecting that at all. At all. 1,750. That's more than my, that's more than my take home wage for a month. That was insane. So every week, this person would take this home. This would be, they can spend this every single week. Uh, I'm, I'm shocked. I genuinely thought it'd be twice as much as that. Very upset. Woman's got 60 pound a week to live on. That's not a lot of money at all. I mean, 60 quid, that's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Roy's having a snoop around the kitchen. It's an income support letter, so she receives 42 pounds and 70 pence a week. Benefits, right? Yeah, yeah. There's another one here from the DWP, the Disability and Carers Service, so it's a disability living allowance. She's a carer for, for her boy. So one of them, yeah, one of them has got a disability. Roy is beginning to understand some of the challenges that Becky faces. He's meeting her mother and sister Lorraine to find out more. I came across something earlier on today which seemed to suggest that she's a carer as well at the moment. What, what's, what's that all about? Finley was born with severe clubfoot. Right. Since then, she's had to care for him and he's got ADHD as well, so he has like meltdowns and things like that. She had no choice but to go on benefits. So if she, if she were to go to work now, would that, would she be worse off financially or could she make it work? She or? would probably be worse off because so at the moment she's getting help towards the rent costs and living costs. But then if she goes into full-time work, that means that her rent. benefits and that will get stopped. Roy's learned that for the moment, Becky's trapped by her circumstances.